All units. All units. 1199. Expedite cover code 3. Deacon Mental Hospital. 184 copy. Code 3. ETA 3 minutes. Copy 184. Sorry, detectives. I know you're just coming off a case, but I'm afraid we're gonna have to make a detour. Sounds serious. Is it a riot? A call went out just before I picked you up. Said it was multiple homicides. Half a dozen units already on scene. 131, please advise. Maybe it's the ghost of that doctor who went schizo and chopped up all those patients. That's not what happened. Some patients disappeared. Some kind of scandal? Still, gives you the creeps, doesn't it? 127, 124, please respond. Joseph, you think there's a connection? It's a possibility. I believe the records were sealed. Anyone on scene, respond. Dispatch, this is Detective Castellanos in 184. What's the situation? Over. 184, be advised. Some problem with the on the scene. Deacon Memorial on Is there any... Uh, God damn it! Jesus! Junior Detective Kidman. Any thoughts? Nothing yet. I'm sure we'll know everything once we get there. Contact dispatch and let them know what's happening. Joseph, Kidman, you're with me. We're gonna have a look around. Right. Smells like blood. All right, stay sharp. We're gonna check it out. Don't let anyone else through this door. I can be an extra set of eyes. We don't know what's happening here. You're a backup. Are you injured? What happened here? Can't be real. Impossible. Ruvik is... I've got him. The security cameras might tell us something.
Find myself within Darkness twisting me around There is nothing I can do And this world doesn't span It just turns itself came out. I waited, but... Uh... Please, settle uh... down, Leslie. Just a few bumps, we're fine. 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 We will be once we're fine. far away. Fine. A little further and we'll be fine. 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 Fall! Fall!
Hello? Anybody there? Are we awake? Is everyone else all right? The city? Whatever are you talking about? You are the only soul here. Right now. Hello? Anybody there? What the hell is going on here? A hospital? This place is necessary for you. You're always welcome here. I've been hospitalized? I'm afraid I cannot answer that. Please, sign in here. You are all right. Please, relax. Please, have a seat. What the hell? You mustn't fight it. This is for your own good. No! Stop! There now, you see? All better. Lady, am I going crazy? Huh? Now what makes you say that? I'll be waiting. What's going on? Where am I? Warning me about this. You are Leslie, right? I'm a police officer. Maybe I should help you. Should help you? Shit. How am I gonna get you to a hospital? Hospital. 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 Hospital! What the fuck? Are you guys from around here? I don't know where.
Better get out of here. Wait! Over here! Wait, uh, officer. You must take me with you. Detective Castellanos. Leslie should be just ahead. It is imperative that we find him. Oh, the hospice. Yes. Leslie was being treated here years ago. He'd come here thinking it was familiar and safe. You know where we are? Just ahead is the hospice my brother runs. He'll take us in. That didn't answer my question. I honestly don't know. For all I know, I'm losing my mind and you're just a delusion. But I'd like to think I still have a shred of dignity and an obligation to protect my patient. As an officer of the law, you should too. I hope his brother's not a jerk too. Valerio, it's me. The good doctor is here. This is my brother, Valerio. Leslie's original doctor. <laughs> Peel away. Yes, expose everything. <laughs> hey, what are you doing?
How could he have done that to Valerio? Impossible. Couldn't be Ruby. He's gone down there. Did you take care of them? Help me. Leslie. Help me. Oh, thank heavens. <laughs> Dr. Hermenis is here. Settle <laughs> down. Wait, <laughs> Doc. I think something's coming. Something here. Settle down. <laughs> Something scary. Be still. No. 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 There's nothing to get rid of. This is a death trap. Is there anywhere safe at all? I think that's unlikely. Hmm. Can't get out. Can't get out. We must be going this way. Can't get away. Can't get away. Must be collectively losing our minds. 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 Oh God. No. Rovik. It is you. Ah! Who the hell are you? <laughs> no. Don't follow. What the? Doctor? Leslie? Fuck. What is going on here?
Seems someone wants me hospitalized. Joseph! Thank God you're okay. <coughs> I don't know what I am. But it's definitely not okay. Brought me here? <coughs> Jesus, what happened? My head feels like... Like... Do you hear that? We need to get out of here. Can you move? Yeah, I... Joseph! Looks pretty sophisticated. Why would they put a bomb like this? Do you think we can get past it? Stand back. Let me see if I can disarm it. something electronic. <laughs> Joseph, after Connolly, I thought... I, I don't know what came over me. <coughs> I, I haven't been feeling well, but... <sighs> Look, let's just get out of here. There's something wrong with this place. Yeah. And not a single discharge. Fine, 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 
Fine. 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 Do you stand with Mobius? I do. I made my choice. I've got to get out of here. Leslie. Leslie Withers. I'm sorry? Kid, I need you focused. I need your attention. This is a serious matter. Everything we do is a serious matter. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'd like to think so, but conviction must be proven with action. As I was saying, your target is Leslie Withers. He's a patient at Beacon Mental Hospital. But he's something more. Simply put, we need him to run our STEM system. Without this asset, our research will mean nothing. I don't understand. We own Beacon. Why not just take him? Our relationship with his advisor, Marcelo Jimenez, has become rather strained. The boy is a leverage piece. Jimenez plans to activate a STEM prototype at Beacon without our permission. Obviously, that's unsuitable. 
Have no illusions. It will be dangerous. Come, take a walk. The nurses are waiting. come from If Jimenez activates the system, you'll be pulled in. Hopefully he doesn't. But as a precaution, we've prepared an infusion to prevent... contamination. Like a vaccine? To protect me? More accurately, to hide you. We developed STEM. But there is a ghost in the system. Something we call... Ruvik. It means to keep us out. This infusion should protect you to some extent. Why send me alone? You won't be alone. You'll be with your team from KPD. You'll get a call on the radio reporting an incident at Beacon. Everything will be arranged. But there are consequences of little value. In regards to your mission, they're expendable. Come, sit down. We must have that boy. He will enable us to change everything. I'll come back with him. I needn't remind you the consequences for failure. Loyalty is a sensitive subject for us. Trust is such a valued commodity in today's world. So once again, I ask you, do you stand with Mobius? I do. I made my choice. Now you must back up your words with actions. Do not waver. Oh. Now I'm going to count down. And when I'm finished, I'll ask you a series of questions. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Now I'd like to ask you some questions. Have you ever felt abandoned by the ones you trusted?
Oh, shit. What could have done this? force it open with the computer. Analyzing data. thing used its light. This is from before. Leslie, is he really here? <laughs> Leslie is here. Okay, I gotta get to him before anything else does. feel so heavy in here. This is not a negotiation, Dr. Jimenez. We are expected to reach a solution, hence the founding of this facility. I understand that. And I appreciate the time you've given me. Time has a limit, and we're approaching that point. If you've outspent your usefulness, we will need to find someone more suitable. Let's not be so hasty. I've done tests with our visual diagnosis, and there is something I must speak to you about. Please, come with me. The projector is in the next room. It's my hypothesis that we haven't succeeded because so far we've only been using visuals, audio stimuli, passive influence, even on my patients with limited mental capacity. This method is rejected by the user. If we are to accomplish what we intend, we will need to refocus. 
We need direct access. And what do you propose? It's, how shall I say, a pet project of sorts. A mechochemical process. With it, we should be able to have a direct influence on the individual. Potentially even access their subconscious. I have the data in the next room. Let me show you. That video. I remember they showed me that when I was brought here. This research here, this is exactly what we've been looking for. I call it STEM. I'm sure you and your superiors will find this most satisfactory. You mentioned the design was from a pupil of yours. In that case, where do you fit in? He is an unstable individual. Perhaps it is better that I continue to be the one to contact in this situation. I'd like you to bring this man in. We should all be able to have a productive conversation. What did you say his name was? Ruben. Ruben Victoriano. That's where Leslie was before. And now those two, where are they headed? Agent Stacks, terminated. Please contact biometrics. Find Leslie and bring him back. That's all that matters. Another trap. Look. <laughs> it's much more elaborate. <laughs> Joseph, are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I think you'd better get down here. Hold on, I'm coming. Shit, let's hurry it up! Here they come! How many of these things are there? Come on! 
There's another control panel around here. We're running out of time. Where do these cables go? I'll go. Tell me what to do. Okay. Make it convincing. Detectives! I'm here! I'm safe! Sebastian! Joseph! Mobius. So they sent you to take the boy back. And you trust him. Don't kid yourself. You're just as expendable as your partners are. As I was. After all I did for them. We'll see how loyal you are when you know the truth. Are you all right? Coming. Sebastian. Are you guys all right? We're all right. Just a few bumps. We're fine. It looks like the door's locked from the other side. Sebastian, maybe we can lift this enough for Kidman to go under and open it from the other side. We're counting on you. All right. Let's get going. We should go. I'm glad you're both all right. It's odd, though. Why would they catch you instead of just killing you? Maybe he didn't see me as a threat. He? doors. Unbelievable. There can be no mistake. 
This one has compatible. Has something startled you? Did they do something to my head? You don't look well. You should take better care of yourself. What was that sound? Sebastian? 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 Do you wish to remain in the dark about information that will undoubtedly disturb you? Joseph! Joseph! Uh, shit! Where did he go? Well, he'll just have to fend for himself. Gotta keep on track. Find Leslie. Designing the entirety of the system by himself. 
but we conflicted over our intentions. And what happened to him? Reuben has been dealt with. The consequences of trusting in the wrong people. Ruvik, he knows I'm here. Joseph, you're all right. You too, thank God. Any sign of Sebastian? Nothing. Maybe we can go back and look for him. No. I mean, let's just get out of here first, then we can worry about Sebastian. Can we open this gate? I doubt you and I are strong enough. <laughs> Joseph, watch yourself. I'll be fine. Quick, look around, see if there's another way out. focus kid I warned you about that how could this place exist I don't understand what's happening in here Ruvik knows you're here he's feeding off you but there are more important problems that detective Joseph isn't something to worry about he doesn't suspect anything. he's expendable how else do you want me to say it remove him that's an order killing Joseph that's not going to help me find Leslie. He can't be trusted. He'll turn on you. They all will, once they know what you're after. We told you. You're weak, kid. And you're disappointing us. Are you guys all right? We're all right. Sebastian. 
Maybe we can lift this enough for Kidman to go under and open it from the other side. We're counting on you. <sighs> It's odd, though. Why would they catch you instead of just killing you? Maybe he didn't see me as a threat. He. I know who you are. I'm not going to let you take him. You should have followed your orders, kid. Damn it! <laughs> you couldn't have gone far. <laughs> there you are! <laughs> Don't run! Just let me get a clean shot! <laughs> you couldn't have gone far. <laughs> you can't hide. This is the photographs. Are you all right? My head wouldn't stop buzzing. It felt like it was about to crack open. But now it's like... I'm starting to get used to it. You seen Kidman? No. Next thing I knew, I was here. I must have blacked out or... Maybe I turned again. Inside. Let's go. Another one? Let's 
Let's rest for a minute. We can't keep going at this pace. I... I think we've got to get out of this place as fast as we can. What about the tower there? We might be able to get a lay of the land. Anything's got to be better than staying here. Kidman is okay? I don't like that they used her as bait. Almost like someone's toying with us. Hang in there. Just a little further. It's not. Okay. I'm fine. No need to worry. Just let them. Huh? What the hell? It's just a matter of time. It's better this way. What the fuck? Hide out in here for a minute. <laughs> Is this what it was like, Seb? After the accident? Well, I never put a gun to my head. No, of course not. Just quietly sank into a bottle. 
We can't all be perfect. It never affected my work. But hey, you read the IA report. You know I didn't report you because I was worried about your work, Sebastian. <sighs> what else is there? We don't have time for this. I need my partner here. I'm counting on you. Hold on a minute. Let me climb up here and see if I can get a look ahead. You all right? Yeah. Hey, that's Kidman. Who's that she's with? <clears throat> what I found. Seems to be in working condition. Go on ahead, I'll cover you. I'll cover you. Wait, there was something about a horse in that house back there. Let me see what I wrote. I guess we go down. I guess so. Are there sins you are ashamed of? Wait a second. This house... No, it can't be. Mother would sit in her chair, rocking back and forth, killing time until the next service. She barely spent any time with us. I wondered why she even had children at all. In life, we constantly search for a place we feel safe. A home we can always come back to. We imagine that place in our minds and are drawn to it. You had a home, but now that place is here with us. Please let it be Leslie.
gotta get to him before those things do. Leslie, it's all right. It's safe now. You can let me in. Safe? It's safe now? It hurts. Yeah, that was close. He's here. Finally found you. <laughs> You're not hurt, are you? I'm getting stronger. I can't get away. We'll be fine, Leslie. Sure. How am I gonna get us out of here? Church, please. The church. Please. Church. 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 All right. Church. Come on. Church. Stay close to me. I'll protect you. Church. See, Leslie? We're almost there. Just a little further. <laughs> Shit. Leslie, you've got to hide. Don't come out until I call you. Come on, the church is right ahead. It should be a little safer in there. It's all right. I'm here. Nothing is going to get you. You have to stay with me. There's no other way. He's here! <clears throat> Ruvik, what do you want with me? You. I'm just making sure you're doing your job. Just like me, I doubt they want damaged goods. Back up! He's coming with me! Oh. I hope so. I needn't remind you the consequences for failure. Your people aren't the only ones counting on this boy. You need him to get out. As do I. We're all their pawns. Eventual victims. They killed me. They ripped me apart and took what they needed. I will destroy what they wish to control. Ruvik? Stop it! Let him go! He is my vessel. I am in control. I sense a conflict of interest. Just what was your mission exactly? Do you think their all prying eyes can't see in here? 
They've been watching you, kid. What are you doing, kid? You are to bring the boy back to us. No! I can't! If I bring Leslie out, Ruvik comes with him. We don't know what he's capable of. I... I can't let that happen. You swore allegiance, but you are not in a position to make decisions like this. This is not acceptable behavior. You will bring us back that boy. Run all you want, kid. You can't escape. Like everyone else that crosses us, we will hunt you down. Kid, you have a job to do. Enough games. Stop running. No, stop. Get away from me. need to worry about me. Can you get it open?
Joseph. What is it? I dropped my glasses back there. Fuck. It's not just about being unable to see. It's about feeling normal. It's all right. Let's focus on finding Kidman. Jeez, Joseph, all that for a pair of glasses. That sounded close. It's all right, I'm here. Nothing is gonna get you. Get you, get you, get you, get you, get you, get you. You have to stay with me, no other way. Sebastian, you ever had the urge to just jump? When you're on a high place, <coughs> where the subway rolls by. Imagine if you had that urge for a minute straight, then two minutes. You fought it off three times now, Joseph. You're learning to stop it. You're not listening. I'm not worried about stopping it, Seb. I'm worried about not wanting to stop it. Some part of me wants to turn. I don't know why, and I can't reason it away. It's deeper than that. It's like instinct. And it's getting stronger. Hold on. This way.
Leslie, you're safe. Where's... Kid. Kid. Kidman? Is she here too? Kid. Kid. Is she all right? Is she all right? All right? Stand back. I'll get it open. observed in subjects number 25 and 33, and now again in 55. The one common factor is a case history of disassociative identity disorder. Previous experiments on the prefrontal cortex led to degradation of sense of self, but there were unanticipated results here. Suicidal thoughts of alternate personalities exhibited as attacks on the core personality. As self-consciousness waned, a sort of stasis was achieved. 
Like two creatures sewn together and forced to live as one, eternally hating the other. Delicious. What the hell is going on? There's no time. I need to figure out how to reverse this if we're going to stop him. Who? This Ruvik guy? Who the hell is he? I'm sorry, I have to find this. I can't help if you leave me in the dark, Doc. And you need me to help. He... We... We're working on a method. How can I explain this? It's... Like linking brains together. Sharing everything on an electrochemical level. Emotion, memory, perception, everything. Directly. It's unprecedented. The implications on psychology, on pharmaceuticals, on consciousness itself. Are you serious? It's a fucking nightmare. Well, I didn't say it was perfect. Especially not with such a... Unstable host. Great. So your research partner is a psychopath. And we're all inside his head. N not exactly, no. All of us are contributing on some level. But he's the only one with conscious influence. You know how he thinks. What does he want? Well, it's just a theory, but... I'd say he wants us dead. Doctor? Detective Castellanos. Was that... someone else's memories? You were moaning in your sleep. Have a bad dream? from agitating the others.
You look as if you'd seen a ghost. seen that house somewhere. I've never been here before, but... How did they get here? I am most impressed. Why are you back? I didn't give you permission. Come now, we're both men of science. Men of science are dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge. You can show me your experiments. I can show you things. You wouldn't like them. You'd think they're gross. In science, one must do any number of things a layperson may find disgusting. I've done many things others would consider distasteful. You think I'm some kind of a monster? You concern yourself so much with your appearance. But that mind of yours, that's all that matters. 
That's Marcello. Is that Ruvik with him? hospital has not received the family's usual donation this year. And why would they? Has the hospital been doing anything worthy of donation? The Victoriano family has always been a generous contributor. Where are your parents? They have gone away. When do you expect them? Is there something you wish to discuss, Doctor? I came to inform you that the hospital will no longer be able to provide you with assistance. Materials. Your research will very quickly disintegrate. How dare you come into my home and threaten me?
slice clean all the way. No cure for what I'm going to do to you. Peel pristine skin. Thoughts from the... Rovik? secrets haunt you? Do you wish to tell them, but something holds you back? Come back, kid. You have a job to do. No! Stop! Get away from me! Stop running! Is it over? I'm back? What's going on? Where is this place? I'm afraid I cannot answer that. Are you kidding me? Ugh, waste of time. Hey! I know you're out there! This world is the way it is. Hate. Hate. Ruvik's hate. The man's consumed by it. He wants out! Wants to get his revenge! He wants back what he feels the world took from him. Who's that? How does he know about Ruvik? still here, then he must be too. Too bad they dragged you into this. But either way, you're mine. To do with 
as I please. Sebastian. He must be somewhere else right now. Damn it, he doesn't have anything to do with this. We must have that boy. He will enable us to change everything. I'll come back with him. I needn't remind you the consequences for failure. I know. But if Ruvik leaves with him, there must be some way to stop him. Society is wounded. People are suffering. Hopeless. Just as you were. Before we saved you. Mobius can now do the same for everyone. STEM is a machine designed to connect everyone subconscious. And whoever is at the center has the power to influence them. There couldn't be a better tool to change the world to lead. Society needs a curator, and Mobius will be just that, ushering in the next step of humanity. Mobius. Something is pulling me back. be done to make him the blank slate we need. They knew. They knew what Leslie was capable of. Damn it, why would they hide that from me? We had a STEM terminal here, on the lowest floor. If Leslie's in here with me, he's probably headed there. And that may be my way out of here. Anything in here. Chemical lights. Better than nothing, I guess. Although brilliant, Ruben was quite insane. A compromise of ethics on our part. He seemed motivated, obsessed with revenge against something never specified. We discovered what he was doing in secret. Torturing, pinching for traps. A serial killer masquerading around as a scientist. This machine was designed for me. People like you. You took my life away. Turned me into an abomination. 
Finally, with this machine, I can go back. I can live the life I was supposed to have. We are forgiving. We are willing to overlook your certain peculiarities for what you can provide us. But you are testing our limits, our manpower. Our resources are not here for your pathetic fantasy. You will reverse the calibration on the machine so we can use it without you. And what if I say no? You think he menace can fix this? <laughs> you need me, and there's no way around it. Ruvik. No. Reuben. This was where he was doing his research with us. We were just using him. And I doubt he's the first. back. Please enjoy this music while waiting. You've got to be kidding me. Guess I'm all right for now. out of this Jimenez. He brought this upon himself. We gave him a chance. Where is he? If you really wish to know, he's in the next room. Come, see. his own patience to further his own research? The irony of this situation is amusing. But even you must realize what we can do with this. This means... STEM will run. We can continue the experiments. And your assistance... is even more necessary than before. This whole project... from the beginning it was about deceit. What you see here is one of the first STEM prototypes. 
It requires a physical connection from user to host. But Beacon houses a newer version with a wireless transmitter. All the user hears is a high-pitched tone, and they're connected. We've gotten word Jimenez is prepping for unauthorized usage. We would like the trial run to be on our terms, not his. That sound in the patrol car must have been when Jimenez activated it. Joseph, Sebastian, Oscar. They were all pulled in with me. The stem and beacon. That's where it all started. There must be a way to get out of this world from there. dark especially for you kid you're asking too many questions ignoring your mission running from responsibility just like you always do no that's not true you don't know me that much is obvious but we need to make sure you do what you're told you're lying to me hiding things i can't trust you not like this you are not required to trust us, only to obey. Was I led here? Laura, where are you? <laughs> I know you're in here. I can hear you breathing. Think they can buy up all our land? They need to be shown who really owns these parts. <laughs> hey, I think there's kids in there. <laughs> I didn't hear anything. <laughs> what the?
must eat. You've got to keep your strength up. My children. How long? Beatrice, we... The papers say were done to those people, those traps. These vermin, these microbes, they're mine to do with as I please. But you are correct. This was not mere research. I'm close to perfection. This is abhorrent. This is my will. that guy next door. Do you have any idea why this world is the way it is? What? Who are you? Hate. Hate. Ruvik's hate. The man's consumed by it. He wants out! Wants to get his revenge! He wants back what he feels the world took from him. It's not like he could actually get that. <laughs> it's not like he could actually get that. This world exists as long as he does. You heard what? something just now? you do. Poor little Joseph couldn't. Too bad they dragged you into this. But either way, you're mine. To do with as I please. to save us. Really? Because it looks like you're making another monster to me. I don't have time for this, Detective. Neither do I. <sighs> Let's 
Leslie has been here before, and made it back. He survived being linked to Ruvik, the only patient ever, as far as I know. Wonderful. What does that have to do with any of this? He's our way out, Detective. Our only way back. Breaking a stem terminal? Never thought he'd go that far. Wait, stem? Oh, he must be close if he's severing ties with the past. All he has left is his connection to the present. The full stem in the hospital. Hospital? Beacon Mental Hospital? That's where he'll be. Waiting for him. If somebody doesn't get there first... There'll be no way out for anyone! You have an odor of blood about you. You were assigned to your team for a reason. Castellanos, Oda, they know nothing. But they're searching for answers. Searching for us, you mean? 
one of us. But this may be our chance to remove them. Having all of you in one place will provide us with opportunities. going fine. Just wish my wife would be home more to take care of her. She barely took maternity leave, huh? One of Crimson's finest, I suppose. She's a great cop in her own right, but we can manage without her for a little longer. You should hope she doesn't hear you say that, or you'll be out in your ass, Joseph. This looks like it's way before I got here. Everyone's so much younger, but Sebastian's profile didn't say he was married. Let alone a child. Look, Seb, we need to talk. Going off with your conspiracy theories? You're getting out of control. You don't pull that in front of the captain. I'm on to something, Joseph. I don't need you hiding shit from me, too. I'm not, Sebastian. I'm trying to help. I want to help. But you need to think about this carefully. Your daughter... It was a loss everyone on the force felt. But your wife is... Myra left, Joseph. She left. When we needed each other the most, Myra left me. What would make her do that? I have to know. I don't care what it costs. His daughter, then his wife? One right after the other? No wonder he always seemed so closed off. Julie Kidman? She barely has any experience. And we don't even know anything about her. Send her out canvassing witnesses then. Let her see the streets. No. She's... she's coming with us. I'm going to train her. She's my responsibility. Look, I know you say it's personal, and I don't like to talk about it. But we can't have your misplaced guilt leading to rookies slowing us down. Sebastian. He and Joseph weren't supposed to be involved. It shouldn't have happened like this. <gasps> this is Crimson? This can't be real. I just hope I can get there before he does. You said I shouldn't be. But I am thankful. I don't know what would have happened to me if you hadn't brought me in. chance to prove yourself to us, kid. Don't let us down. Bring the boy to us. Stop it! Get out of my head! Sebastian. And Joseph, too. I dragged you into this. What have I done?
Did Ruvik send you? Well, I hope he gets the message. Save it for later. There are probably more of them around. <laughs> Save it for later. There are probably more of them around. Look out! I'm so glad you're all right. Ever since the church, I... You were at the church? Yeah, Joseph and I. He's in bad shape, or at least he was when I last saw him. What about the boy from the hospital? Leslie? I found him in a cage. He freaked and ran, though. I think we've all been seeing strange things. Have you been having any nosebleeds? Headaches? No. Why? Joseph was. It's like he was turning into one of those things. Maybe it doesn't affect everybody.
Sorry for putting you through this. I don't want to hurt you any more than I already have. You might try to stop me through you. A little hasty with that gun, kid. What is it you plan on doing? What I have to do. No! You do what we say. You will come back with that boy, or you will disappear. What is this? Did you shoot me? You started turning into a monster. You attacked me. I'm sorry, but you're tainted now. You might try to stop me through you. Wait, what are you talking about? Get it open. Get it open. Get it open. Leslie? Leslie, is that you? Leslie, that's good. Just a little more. What is it? Ruvik? Help, 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 help! Hey! Leslie? Thank God you're all right. How did you get here? It wasn't easy. At least I haven't had any more... Uh, episodes. I wish I could say the same. Hey, I think I might have found us some transportation. Think you can do anything to stop this? Stop, damn it! You don't understand! We don't need. Fuck this place. 
place. Joseph. I've got a theory. We seem to be moved around an awful lot. Almost as if by someone's will. So it's nearly impossible to get any sense of the geography around here. But the light. Beacon Mental Hospital. It's always in the distance. This thing you found me hooked up to. I've seen it in more than one place. Yeah, so have I. It seems like it's the same exact one, but it's hard to be sure. The thing that I've noticed is that each time I run across one, I seem to be closer to the lighthouse. It could be a coincidence, but like I said, it seems as if there is some intelligence behind it. So you figure we ought to cut to the chase and just head straight for the hospital? Exactly. Nice work, Detective. The right side looked like it led more directly toward the hospital. Just get us out of here. There's an ambulance there. There might be some kind of first aid. I'll go. No, I'll do it. Don't let any of them on board. Can you discern between evil and good? <coughs> no, no, no! Damn it! Maybe I can burn through it.
Don't risk it. Hold on. I think I see another way down. I'll meet you on a lower level. At least they're all right. Please, just stay out of my way. of him. Maybe I can stop him. Maybe I can stop Ruvik then. <sighs> Leslie! Leslie, where are you? It's all right. Everything's gonna be fine. I hope. Not safe. Hurry! This way! Is it... over?
I hope that bastard doesn't come back. For your sake, Leslie. Kidman? unless we get down there. If you're down there, hang on. We're coming. Jesus. What could cause this much damage? Is that a subway sticking out of the ground? Yeah, but look how it's positioned. If we can get over there, we might be able to use it to get across. Let's just concentrate on getting out of here. Another way down. I'll meet you on a lower level. No, no, not that way. No. Haven't you figured it out yet? Oh, he loves tormenting others. Has to let them know he has the upper hand. Lays out the bait, gets his victim all worked up. His unholy traps. When it was happening to me, I could see what was going on. I could see it, but I couldn't turn back. I had to know. I had to know the truth, and he knew it. Detective Castellanos. Lady, level with me. Am I going crazy? If one wishes to survive, one would do well to consider who they trust. Again. Damn it. Fuck.
Then better find Kidman. I guess she's all right. What's she after? Leslie can go home, can take the train all the way home. No, Leslie, not today. You'll protect me? Yes, that's my job. Good, good, good. When I get home, they'll be surprised. understand you don't know what he'll become we know exactly what he'll become that's why we need him you don't understand what Ruvik is after Ruvik is a corpse he's after Leslie and so are we and you're more afraid of him than us don't patronize me I have orders but I can't let him have this boy Leslie is the only one who can He's too far gone. I've got to stop him. What are you afraid of? What could haunt you so? What could you need that only we could be the ones to fill it? Was your waste of life something you wished to return to? Are you not grateful for what we've done for you? We let you into our circle. We gave you a new life. Why will you turn your back on us? Why will you not stand with us? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up and get out of the way!
patients are dying when connected to the machine? What are you implying, Jimenez? After what you did to him, now all of this is just conjecture. But it's as if Ruben's consciousness remains trapped inside Stem, and he's attacking anyone attempting to enter. This is inexcusable. We need to get around this. We can't have come all this way for nothing. Ruvik. He was in STEM all along. Well, he's not gonna get me. as a child. His family was murdered in front of him. The data would suggest that brainwave synchronization with Ruben correlates to specific trauma. In this case, Ruben's own loss of family. This will not do. We need something else at the core. Something more acceptable to a whole range of people. Someone rational inside STEM. Potentially that person could neutralize Ruben. I mean, Ruvik. With my knowledge of the system, I may be of some. Absolutely not. We can't afford you complicating this any further. We will prepare one of our own. Sending someone inexperienced, we we can't even be sure they can come back. Then it will need to be someone expendable. Expendable. So that's how you see me. And I trusted you. <laughs> now. Sebastian was here? What did you put in me? We needed to know if one of us could survive in the system. But we're not about to risk anyone of value. You were sent to carry us in with you. So here I am. No. It's Rubik. He's making all of this. You gave yourself to us. 
You made the choice of your own free will. We were the only ones who cared. The ones who took you from your useless life. We gave you a reason to exist. And how do you thank us? By destroying our work? Where will you go when you leave us, kid? Who will have you? Why would you abandon the cause? Who are you trying to save? A world that didn't care about you in the first place. wandered into some kind of nest. You published my research in your name again. Did you think I wouldn't find out? And I have done you a favor. You have no credentials. You'd never appear in a reputable journal otherwise. Nobody in the world knows you even exist. Oh, but they will know. I have surpassed you in every way you can imagine. No matter. I have what I need. All that's left is the procedure. Indeed. That is why we are here. We? You wouldn't dare. You couldn't complete it without me. Precisely. <laughs> Trying to make me feel sorry for you?
Losing our minds. Losing our minds. Losing our minds. Losing our minds. This way. <laughs> this way. It's going to come down. This way. Beacon, just like Joseph said. I knew it. on yourself. Yeah. <sighs> 
supposed to mean? You'll see. Poor guy. Rest in peace. Answer our questions. Is it out of fear? Fear is such a subtle thing. But when one experiences true fear, is when they can be controlled. They can be molded. STEM is an abortion, a machine designed on the premise of fear. 
But in a sense, it is perfect for what we hope to achieve. You will be the first. You will bow under this fear, or you will die. You will serve as an example for what we will become. Leslie, wait! Don't go in there! This is me. I'm connected. Just like everyone else. I'm getting out of here. Sebastian, get away from him. Sebastian, listen to me. Stop. Your interests are the same as ours. Look, I get it. You're not just some rookie detective, and this is not just some ordinary kid. You killed Joseph and you shot me. So right at this moment, that's enough reason for me not to trust you. You're a good man. That's why I... It doesn't matter anymore. If you know who this kid is, if you know anything, you know why he can't be allowed to live. Bullshit. It's Ruvik. He's the one that...
and you failed. No. None of this is real. You aren't real. You want to believe that, but I'm right here. I've been with you this whole time. This world is a nightmare. But I'm not afraid of you anymore. That just shows how little you understand. You should be very afraid. We have you, kid. And you know the consequences for failure. We won't let you just leave us. You fulfilled what little use you have. This world is a prison for you to rot in. Fuck you. I've had enough of this. I'll kill you right here. It's a shame you'll never see what we accomplished. You 
You think you've won. But have you? You don't know anything. I am with you. I will always be with you now. You don't know me. I'm stronger than you think. Are you sure enough in yourself? Sure enough to face the responsibilities of your actions? Agent Kidman, we've got him from here. How long has it been? 37 minutes since the first pulse. How did we get here? What are you talking about? Uh, just give me a minute. I need to get Myra. my head straight. Myra, we need you back here. All right, but we've got word he wants a debriefing as soon as you get back. They didn't count on you. I owe you one. Welcome back to the real world, Sebastian. I hope you find what you're looking for. Leave that one. And those two. They're not going anywhere. No one is. Sign, sir. Leave that one. And those two. They're not going anywhere. No one can. Ugh. <laughs> 
Go, go! Detective, are you all right? Is there anyone else? Just give me some real fresh air.